welcome 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 to big red leads i am big red i want to talk to friends and family today i want to talk to you guys about enough or better the reason i say enough a lot of people think of enough as i make enough money i think i did enough I've had enough of today. I've had enough. It's not really enough. And when I say enough, I'm going to use this word quite a bit. Understand. Did you do your best? Did you do your best? Can you get better? Understand that everything that you need as far as who you are and what you want for your life is enough you are enough you have everything inside of you that you need it just needs maybe a quote or an, an inspirational moment or a mentor or something that something tragic could have happened something to change the way the mental blocks and simply illuminate them to the point where you can see everything that you are. You are enough. You just need to be activated. It sounds cliche, it sounds corny to some, but you just need to be activated. You know, what you don't know, believe it or not, when you learn it, it's like, and you instantly apply it, magic. It's, it's like everything is magic. But when you leave things on the table, when you leave potential on the table, potential to me is a dangerous word, which in today's society, we want to be dangerous. We don't want to play it safe. Everything is risky. Everything is risky. Life is risky. You want guarantees, bills, and death. Those are your guarantees. Everything else is a risk. Take chances, understand, add skills, you know, work on your intellect, improve your mental capabilities, um, understand that your capacity has not been filled yet, like, you have so much more, like, there's, there's so much more for you that you haven't even touched the surface of what you can become. One of the things that I hear from a lot of clients that it, that just resonates throughout, I'm talking from 70 to 21 years of age. I hear it all the time, and it's it's scary in this sense. I really tried. And the great words of Yoda, there is no try. It's only do. Did you do your best? And something that becomes, it's mentally damaging not to perform up to the best of your abilities when it's showtime. It really messes with your psyche. Have you ever talked to a young athlete and First thing out of their mouth is, I made this many mistakes, and I didn't I didn't put forth the best effort. Do you know how frustrating that is for them? And it can it can work against you. Your brain does everything it can to protect you, to a fault. Your brain will tell you not to get up when that alarm goes off. Your brain will tell you not to do this task because it's too difficult. Your brain will tell you that you are not capable of doing this at this particular junk, this particular time because you don't feel well. It will do everything to sabotage. Self-sabotage is a real thing. People do it every day. Every single day. They break their diet. They don't do their push-ups. They're, they're not reading the book that they need to read. They're not, getting, they're not gaining the knowledge in the field that they're in. They don't speak the languages of the field that they're working in. And when I say languages, understand that languages are 
there's there's levels to this a carpenter does not speak the same language as an electrician an electrician doesn't speak the same language as, a, as an attorney do you understand what I'm saying these are all languages insurance selling insurance is a different language than selling the, than selling cars what what you're dealing with what most of us are dealing with as human beings is we have not tapped in to the enough factor we're too busy stuck on wanting more you are enough you are enough you just need something to activate you truly I believe that to my to my core and when I'm working with someone new I'm just giving you an example of what I'm what I'm talking about right now when I'm working with someone new we don't jump right into the advanced teachings and lessons of sales negotiating marketing advertising personal development we don't jump into the advanced stuff until we deal with the things that are that are quote unquote anchors and weights holding them down it's, it's the push and pull theory if your life has if you have a plan for your life if you have a plan for your dream it can become reality you will not be asleep in your dream you will be living it and be present in that moment but if you're still holding on to those old nightmares and issues and past dramas and mistakes and things that you can just you simply cannot shake we're not talking about mental 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 health we're talking about we're talking about a space of mental health but we're not talking about mental illness we're talking about the mental blocks that you allow to stick around and then they become cancers the willingness to not finish the task the willingness to just simply give up when it gets difficult or when you get frustrated instead of just simply finding another route the destination has not changed the route may have changed if you still get there you're good as long as you're picking up the gems along the, um, along the way you're picking up the nuggets and the knowledge guess what the more you know the less you know I firmly believe that you know an, uh, an intelligent mind is going to ask questions I learned something new I have 10 more questions and that's an everyday thing I spend at least an hour, if not two hours every day, reading something. Why? Because knowledge is in books. Everything you want to know in this world can either be found. Here's where technology kicks in. I'm speaking to younger people. You can look it up on YouTube. You can look it up on Patreon. You can find whatever it is that you're trying to get or gain a little bit of knowledge on. When it comes to a skill set, mindset, just any type of work for self-improvement and personal development, you can find it. Um, in my years of coaching and being in sales and some of the coaches, the personal coaches that I've hired, paid great money to, you know, I had to pay good money to be in just some rooms just to listen. I am a constant student. I ain't telling you to be a follower. When I'm telling you to follow the page, or subscribe to the page, understand, I'm saying so that I can give you as much, much information as I possibly can. Along your path, if you know that you're enough and you just need to be activated into the field that you're going into, there is nothing stopping you but you. Distractions are distractions. That's another video for another time. You are your own distraction what are you allowing to block you from being what you truly are every last person on this planet is here to produce something whether it's a great canvas or 
produce and make the next next wildfire app whether it's composing a song um, litigating a great argument like it, it, whatever it is becoming the fastest man in the world whatever it is for you whatever it is for you what is your dream are you willing to do what it takes to be awake while you live your dream Most people sleepwalk through this life by the time they realize that they left mad potential on the table. They left their cup half full. They're too old to really want to do anything about it. And unless a tragedy comes along, they're not going to change. I'm, I'm the last person to tell people that, that, that change is not real. But understand as a young person your brain is not finished developing until you hit your mid 20's now it doesn't mean if you're older than 27 it doesn't mean that you still can't learn what I'm simply getting at is you are enough enough is your best if you are doing your best and you're pushing stretching intellectually, mentally, physically, spiritually, whatever it is for you to make yourself better. Personal development is is where it's at. You can do whatever you choose to do if you're willing to push yourself. When it gets tough, when it gets uncomfortable, that's when you need to bear down and pull. Pull with everything you have. Anything that you're doing with your hands and your mind, you have to go all in on it. When you go to bed at night, when you go to bed during the day, whenever you lay down to get rest, and rest is a necessity. It's a necessity. You should be exhausted. That feeling of just being drenched in I left it all out there today. I produced today. I did my best work today. I am enough. Should leave you with a, an exhilarating feeling that excites you to the point where it's, it's almost difficult to go to sleep. But you're so exhausted that as soon as your head hits the pillow, you sleep like a baby. If you're leaving, you're enough to that point at the end of each day, you've won. Now, increase that activity. Increase that activity. How much more can I do? How much more can I produce? How much more can I do for others? How much more can I, can I help with my community? How much more can I just involve myself in every facet of this thing that I have designed which is my life have you designed your life where do you see yourself in five years where do you see yourself in two years do you have short range goals long range goals do you want to be financially independent these are all questions that you have to ask yourself and understand with without a plan <coughs> it's not a dream it's a wish. You need to design your life for what you want by starting and understanding that you are enough. More will come to you when you know that you are enough. Hope this message helps. Love you all. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification button. Check out Big Red Leads on Facebook as well. Talk to you later. Love you all. Have a good one, my friends. This is Big Red Leads.